All right, I'm just going to do a quick little intro here. Um, I want to thank you all for watching, and uh, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, we're almost to our goal of 1,000. It keeps going up and up and up, faster and faster. So if you enjoy the video, subscribing is really the best thing you can do, and it's free. So hope you enjoy the video. Alright, welcome back to Pokemon Sun. Um, we just finished up with the preschool. It says I'm still on Route 1, but I'm in Haoli or whatever. Haoli City Beachfront. So we're still kind of in like the tutorial section. Because this tutorial, I remember, it takes like forever to get through. But... Once it's done, it does kind of just let you go. Beach time, yeah! Hey you, you've come to Alola from someplace far off, haven't you? I can tell. Then let me teach you the proper way to greet someone in Alola. Alola! Give it a try too, just like that. Alola, you make more friends if you say it. Okay. Well, he's got plenty of tall buildings. It's even got a tourist bureau of its own. So I'm just going to keep following the flag. Because I honestly want to move on. Howley Shop City Shopping District. Hey, Lando. I thought I recognized the sound of those feet. <coughs> what? So what do you think? Howley is something, eh? Lola's got to be the best place ever to live. Oh, yeah. Hey Lando, come in here with me. I've got an idea, something you could do. Is this where I can, like, change my clothes? Hey miss, is it true that you can get some kind of special gift if you have a Rotom Dex? My goodness, you get the news fast. Hardly anyone has a Rotom Dex, but it's true that we have a special item to go with it. It's your our very own Pokefinder. Here you go. Awesome. Isn't that awesome, Lando? You got a Pokefinder. So, like, what is a Pokefinder? Pokefinder is a tool that lets you take photos of Pokemon. Rotom will help you point out places where you'll be able to take photos, too. Here, I'll read you the instruction manual. I'm never going to use this. <laughs> I remember, like, learning about it the first time I ever played through it. Like, doing this tutorial and everything. But, it's like, it really doesn't do anything. And I... You know, you take pictures of Pokemon in the first little area, but then never use it again. Lando, how? Did you visit the Tourist Bureau? How was it? We got his Rotom Dex upgraded. Now it can take pictures, too. What a wonderful helper, helper you are, Rotom. <laughs> My eyes! <laughs> huh? Uh, what was that for, Rotom? Go and put that little trickster back in your bag, Lando, and follow me. Enough feasting for the eyes. It's time we catch up, take care of our stomachs. Maybe Rotom just wants to flaunt its new camera function and take more photos. Have you thought about trying it out? I think I'll stop by the apparel shop to do some shopping of my own. Alright, just let me go. Just let me... Yo, trainer, look what you've got. Lucky kid, if you've got a Poke Finder, then I guess I'll give you a little tip. See that spot where the wall is cracked? That's a photo spot right there. Look at that, your Rotomy there is trying to tell you too. Give him a tap. Finder's Keepers is... Finder is mine. Press R whenever you see the icon change. I... I don't wanna, but I have to. Firing up the Poke Finder. You can move the camera around by using the circle pad. It's always a good idea to try it when the time is right. Looking good. 
can I like I can't like zoom in or anything. But you've taken some photos already. You should... no. Can I just You've taken all the pics you can in one go. Let's shuffle the photo selection. They're all exactly the same. What kind of photo do you want to show the world, Bucko? They're all exactly the same. It's like fake social media in a video game. I don't get it. Oh. No. Because that's like if you have an SD card in your 3DS, which... Nope. I do not. It's the best to try to photograph Pokemon from the front, you know? If you want to know more about the Pokefinder, well, just keep taking tons of pictures. Okay. Plenty of shops to check out in Hawaii. Even the, an apparel shop. If I had a body, I'd go. Yeah, because that's where Lily's going. So we gotta follow her in there and learn how to buy clothes. Oh, Lando, tell me, did you pick out all your own clothes? Of course I do. Of course, most people do, don't they? I, I've always just worn the clothes that my mother wanted me to wear. I don't really know what kind of thing would suit me. Oh, but that's not why I stopped you. I meant to give you this. I received it inside the apparel shop here. I didn't even buy anything, but they said I was the 99,999th customer to visit the store. But I already have the same one, so I thought maybe you might want it. What is it? Lens case? Okay, I guess that just carries all my stuff. Oh, is it going to let me go through without having to go in into the apparel shop? There's even government offices here, just what everyone's in paradise. Okay. It's gonna make me go through without doing a big huge tutorial on changing my clothes. <clears throat> I saw those Team Skull Numb Skulls loitering around the marina again. I reported it to the captain, of course. This is what happens when young people have nothing to do and too much time on their hands. What a bunch of useless thugs. All they do is drag trainers into battles they don't want and try to steal people's Pokemon. I heard they keep trying to sneak into the trial site to steal Pokemon to sell, and that they fail every single time. Did I hear someone say Team Skull in the marina? Well, that's not good. How's it, Lando? If you're looking for good eats, you found them. Plus, mal Malasada make your Pokemon like you. Make your Pokemon like you, and affectionate Pokemon are better in battle. Who could resist giving their Pokemon a few Malasada, eh? They're just so cute. Now I've got some fuel in me. I want to go right down to the marina and scream out loud, Watch me, Tutu! No. Watch me, world. I'm going to be even my old Gramps someday. <clears throat> Team Skull or Malasadas? How do we choose? I want to check out both. I'm going to the marina. Oh, there's a TM in there, though. Where's the, uh... Echoed voice. That's actually not a bad move, but I think... My picky peck already has it, if I remember correctly. Wingle? I'm just gonna run. Because essentially, I should be okay <clears throat> level wise. Like, maybe once I catch the next Pokemon. I'll level them up a little bit before I move on, or before the first gym leader, but, like, really I should only need to train, like, once. Greetings, it's me, Cap Captain Elima. Yo, 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 check it! Whenever, wherever we meet you, Team Skull don't even greet you.
So, Cap, just give up the Pokemon, yo. Oh, you're from the trainer school. Already made your way to Holy, hmm? <clears throat> what, what, why are you trying to act hard when we already hard as bone out here, homie? Yo, check, <laughs> let's check these fools. Oh my, how terrifying. Only thieves steal people's Pokemon. I won't stand for it. Lando, wasn't it? I'll ask you to take care of that one. I'll get rid of this one. Oh, a battle against those steam skull numbskulls in the marina? Count me in. Yo, check how I changed the game with my mad Pokemon skills. <clears throat> Team Skull Grunt. Zubat. Okay. Go, Toucan Sam! Fighting move. Heck is gonna do the best. Oh, that's not gonna do anything. I got this. But I want Toucan Sam up front to get the more experience because it's it's lower level. That's kind of why I've been using it primarily. Until I find something that is weak against fire. Yeah, because see, Mittens is... I don't use moves like that. For real? Over already? No fair, I was playing a different game. Let's get about this, Port B. Nobody has to know about this. We don't need your whack Pokemon anyway, Alima. Again? Oh my, how terrifying. My thanks to you and your Pokemon. Why don't I heal your team to express my gratitude? Oh, cool. Now we don't have to stop at that Pokemon Center. I must admit, I've been wondering about you since I saw you at the trainer school. Professor Kukui brought you along, and you and your Pokémon seem to defeat our teacher so effortlessly. Very well then, allow me to see if you're ready for my trial. Sure. What, are you gonna battle me? Behold the magnificent Pokémon of the one and only Captain Elima. Alright, I guess we're battling the Captain. Let's hope we're strong enough. Young Goose? Okay. I got something for that. I got a little move called Rock Smash. It's super effective. Which, it's not very strong, but it can also lower their defense. But he's gonna lower my defense without hurting me, though. This should take it out. Hopefully. Don't, like, low roll or something. Okay. Yeah, my attack is much higher than my special. Smeargle. I'll switch. Because if he's gonna sketch, and if I ember, it'll sketch ember. Oh, it's got water gun. That's not good. I may be screwed. Because that wasn't even like a crit. Yeah, Mittens is down. Hmm, 
I might lose. Yep, I lost. All right. <laughs> I was just talking about not having to train up. But, um, so we're going to go all the way back to the Pokemon Center. Um, so I'm going to leave this one here. I know it's a little short, but I'm going to beef up my Pokemon real quick off screen. And then we'll do that again. And we'll beat him right at the beginning of the next episode. So thanks for watching. I'll see you then.